whenever someone really special to us dies, we often hear this big word here. So I want to see if any of you know what this word mean, means, or might be able to tell me some ideas. So the word's grief. So you'll hear grown-ups talking about people grieving. Has anyone heard that? Like us as adults, children and young people grieve too. However, they express themselves very differently. So part of the bereavement support service that we offer here in the Northern Ireland Children's Hospice provides opportunities for children and young people and the siblings to come along to a support day, which involves providing some group work for the children and really offers them a safe space where they can share their grief and express their thoughts and feelings about their brother and sister, um, about their loss and also to have fun because grief is quite heavy and it can be very difficult for some of the young people so it's about giving them permission to, to have fun. What's really important for us is that the children and young people know that they aren't alone in their grief. For many of the children and young people that we work with they may, they may feel quite isolated because they might be the only child or young person, for example, in their school class that has experienced the loss of a brother or sister. So we really want to provide them the opportunity to connect with other children and young people that know what it is to be them and know what it's like to experience that loss. We also want to develop their emotional intelligence in terms of being able to label their emotions so that they can express that to the grown-ups in their life so that they're able to access the support they need at the right time. And we also want to build resilience um, in, in the children and young people that we work with. And that's why it's really important to focus on, you know, what resources do they have available to them that will help them when they're struggling or they have a difficult day. And also giving them suggestions around that of things they maybe haven't thought about. And also it's that peer support that the children and young people can give to each other because when they come to these support sessions, they're at different stages um, of their life, they're at different stages of their grief, and so they will be able to share their experience of what might have helped them at a particular time, and that might be something that is well received by another child or young person in that group.